Just remember, whatever you make your tea, nothing with onions in it. Oh, you can't eat onions now. Mm, I can't even look at one. And there's no need to sound like that. I can't help it. All right, Nicola, I... Good morning. I know you are pregnant. I know. I have known for some time. The one person who doesn't is the father. Oh, not this again, please. You have to tell him sooner rather than later. Jimmy's still got a lot to prove to me. No, you haven't got time. He's going to notice soon that you're having a baby. Either that or he's going to think you've eaten one. Oh, <laughs> thanks. Thank you. I am going to need a whole new wardrobe soon. Oh. Uh, look, I'm going to have to take this. You, you carry on. Mm. Jimmy. Yep. Oh. Why do they assume you're all pink and fluffy the moment you get pregnant? You know, and they should try being a beach whale with fat ankles. See how pink and fluffy they think you are then. Nice and busy as usual, I see, Nicola. I am allowed break, you know. Oh. What are you doing here? Rodney. Do you think I might have a minute alone with Nicola? Now? Yes. Please. OK. Ah, ah. Now, uh, just the man there, Sarah. Something I wanted to show you, Nathan. What's going on? Hey, wait a second. Um, you know those prints that I was... Hi. Jimmy? Up you get. You know, I'm serious. I'm sorry, but it has to be this way. If I don't do it like this, it's not going to happen at all. What? Oh, flipping heck. It's here somewhere. What is? Hold on. Uh, Nicola. <laughs> I love you more than anything in the entire world. <laughs> and you would make me the happiest man alive. If you say yes. I mean, it's just a normal day and then suddenly you come in here and ask this. I don't know if you've noticed, but I'm still down here. We've only just got back together. I know, but obviously everything's different now. In what way? Well, we've been apart, and we know how miserable we are without one another. Oh, yeah, yeah, of course. But still... <laughs> at least have a look at it. It's very nice. Sold my car to buy it. Really? Oh, it's just a car. I'd do anything to make you happy. Seriously. I do love you. Yeah. Yeah. It, 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 it's so sudden, that's all. I know. I know. Uh, well, take as long as you like. You don't have to answer now. But in the meantime, do you think I could get up? I think my leg's gone to sleep. what I said. Why well, did that go down? I told him I'd think about it. And, have you? Yeah. No conclusions yet. Here we go. The thing is, he really cares. He sold his car to get the ring. I mean, it wasn't much of a car. Actually, it wasn't much of a ring either, if I'm Nicola. honest. Nicola. He did it because he cared. That's what I'm saying. He loves me. And you love him? Yeah, of course I do. Well, everything's right then, isn't it? Except I'm having his baby. Not usually an obstacle to marriage. Yeah, but he doesn't know. Uh, uh, when he finds out, he'll be furious that I kept it from him. What's so furious that he won't want to marry you? Well, possibly. Laurel, if I accept, I'll be his fiance and I've lied to him. Look, it boils down to this. If you think you're right for him and you love him, say yes. If not... What's in now? I should really complain or be told what's going on or anything. No, no, just a minute, just a minute. Thank you. See you tomorrow. Nicola? The neck, Edna, it's only a pen. <laughs> well? Yes. Really? <laughs> yes. <laughs> 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 There's wine. Sit down, rest your brain. Listen, I know it's not. I mean, 
if I had the money, I'd have got a really classy one, but, well, it, it's... It's um... perfect. Really? Hmm. The perfect ring for the perfect marriage. Um, we're going to be perfect together. Yeah. We're two of a kind, you and me, aren't we? Right for each other. Some people might say deserve each other. <laughs> and we're going to have everything that we want. Everything? Yeah. Yeah, we will. <laughs> Including... Just, you know, everything. We've got a surprise for you. Oh. Mm -hmm. Ta-da! What? <laughs> what do you mean? Were you two... We're engaged. <laughs> oh, that's wonderful. Hey, congratulations. <laughs> and you too. Thanks, Rodney. <laughs> oh, you can call him Dad. He's not keen. <laughs> How do you do? Didn't I mention I asked his permission to marry you? Oh, how sweet. Uh, yeah. Look, while we are on the subject of fatherhood... Oh, shouldn't someone get the drinks in? Sure. Uh, a glass of wine? No, I'm not. I'll have another one to choose, so I'm not really in the mood for wine. Really? Really. Uh, brandy, is it, Rodney? If you didn't tell him. But... But you're engaged. I know. I couldn't. Why not? not? I just lost my nerve. I didn't want to put him off for a start. Oh, it was really lovely, Dad. He was proposing to me because he wanted to and not because I was pregnant. Look, I, I will tell him. Yes, I suppose at some point you'll have to. <laughs> Say the baby's third birthday. I'm just waiting for the right moment, that's all. And when I tell him, it will be the biggest, most wonderful surprise of his life. Yeah. Oh, trust me, Dad. We're going to be really happy. <laughs> <laughs>